Oh my gosh, okay. Ah. I'm going to end my life. Hey guys, okay, so I know what you're thinking, Paige, why in the actual are you doing this? So I know this was a trend a minute ago. People were like, oh, cold showers are so good for you. Cold showers will change your life, all this, blah, blah, blah. And listen, I'm all for health, reinventing myself, becoming the best version of me, all of that, you know? So I was like, you know what? Let's give it a try. So I've actually done my research. I know you wouldn't believe it, but I did. And what I've discovered is cold showers actually supposed to help you mentally thinking every day you do the same thing, you push through the same obstacle, and then by the end of the week, you've faced that struggle every single day. Secondly, I've also heard that you're supposed to do something that makes you catch your breath every day and this definitely makes me not able to breathe so i think that's also good for my health um it's also supposed to make you skinny and make you lose fat which i don't think is true but like if it works it works you know let's see if i end up being a skinny healthy well-minded strong-minded independent um new person by the end of this video yeah okay one habit that I've been trying to get better at is drinking more water. So here I have my fancy little water bottle from Air Up. All you gotta do is fill it up and then you put the cap on and you can choose from a bunch of different flavors. Today I wanted peach. And then it comes with a bunch of little pods. All you gotta do is take one out, unwrap it, and then stick it on the top. There aren't any artificial flavors or added sugars or anything like that. All you do is pull it up a little bit and then you basically taste what you smell. If you're interested, definitely click the link in my description to check it out. The brand is called Air Up and you can use my code PAGE10 for 10% off. All right, guys, so I've officially concluded the week seven days of cold showers. Day one, um, awful, felt like shit, hated it, hated my life, wanted it to end. No, okay. It's not cold. It's not cold at all. Okay, I'm just gonna go in the water. Also, because I'm in the shower, um, I'm wearing a bathing suit, so this is also kind of like a slash bikini haul. Yeah, my shower though, my shower time was two seconds, literally two seconds. Was I clean? Probably not, but all I wanted and all I was focused on was getting out of the shower. All right guys, this is day one of cold showers. Yeah. Afterwards, let me tell you, here's some aftermath. I thought it was gonna like get better, like the ocean, you know? You're really cold at first and you get used to it, you know? But no, I still have goosebumps. I don't know if you can see this, but it's literally insanely cold. What makes it worse is that it's cold outside and it's freezing in this house. Yeah, you know what? I feel pretty good. I feel all right, I'm just really cold. Also, I was gonna change it to hot at the end because I was dying. That's not what we're doing. We're going full hardcore in it to win it. Okay, day one. Day two. Today is not a hair washing day. It wasn't that bad, honestly. One thing that I've discovered is after the gym, I always get home and tired as hell afterwards. But I've already had like 200 milligrams of caffeine before the gym. That shower surprisingly made me energized. Okay, day three. Day three. Can we just talk about the commitment though? I had to shower at the gym and I still took a cold shower and filmed it in the gym. One thing that I realized, I guess this is kind of like a... A correlation to your life. I don't know. This is so dumb. I'm just like speaking like I know shit when I don't know anything. When you first go in the shower, you kind of set yourself in a zone. You're like, you know what? I know what I'm about to face. I know that I have to just suck it up and get in. Day four. All right, guys. I know this lighting is a little black, but I actually I have to sh take a shower tonight. I have to use artificial light, so it looks a little weird. But yeah. But here we go. Day. Maybe? Today we have a different problem because um, I need to shave really, really bad. Like, really bad. Like, it's time. These goosebumps are no joke. Like, when you try to shave with goosebumps, it hurts a lot. But we're gonna try it. So, you know, new day, new, new, learning something new, I guess. Also, this process sucks because shaving takes a minute and I'm trying to keep my shower like two minutes long, not even. Okay. Okay, it doesn't hurt. I don't know why I thought it was gonna hurt. I don't know why I said that. Okay, day five. This is when I started to notice kind of um, differences. First off, my hair could go a lot longer without getting oily. My scalp gets really dry when I get out of the shower and just in life in general. Um, secondly, my body didn't feel as dried out. Usually when I get out of the shower, I have like heat rashes everywhere, but also I shower at like 130 degree temperature. 
low-key the cold shower made me already feel refreshed and i didn't feel like dry i didn't feel as crispy if you will also one thing i noticed was with motivation like this is for day six too day six day five day six kind of combined together you already know what you're doing you know that it's gonna suck and you still get up and you still do it that's the part that got me i was like wow you know what that's life <laughs> so motivational i know getting up every single day having that habit being able to trust yourself and your word and what you tell yourself you're gonna do i think that's says a lot the last day day seven i'm not gonna lie it was the same as every other day <laughs> but it was kind of just like a you know what i i did it i sound like a fucking cheesy ass motivational speaker at like a <laughs> high school graduation <laughs> I went to go get lunch with my mom and my dad. My mom goes, you look like you lost some weight. So you know what? Maybe the rumor is true. Maybe cold showers do make you lose fat. You know what? I think it is because when you're in there, you're shivering. Like I, Hot showers make you sweat, but cold showers make you shiver. You work for it. You're running in. You're running to the soap. You're lathering that shit on, rinsing it off, and getting out in two seconds. That's like that's like a marathon. That, I think this was kind of like an example of like first week, first two weeks are the hardest part. But then after that, it becomes like a like a routine will i do this will i keep in my routine uh no but you know what it was fun well it lasted inclusion cold showers are good for you and you should try it you should try it out sometime well thanks guys for watching this video hopefully you learned something hopefully you enjoyed watching me struggle for a week straight hope you guys have a great day set new goals accomplish new things i believe in you i believe in you also i don't know why i'm holding this i just like it i feel like i'm like a professional speaker all right guys i will see you next week